year for the Emmy Award winning Lacky News Center. Over the next week, Texas will be experiencing some crazy weather. Now we will go to Matthew Menace for the weather report. Hello, I am Matthew Menace, and I will be reporting your local Texas weather. As I just said, we will be experiencing some crazy weather in Texas. Over the next five days, we will be experiencing crazy weather such as hail, tornadoes, and heavy rain. On Monday, Texas will receive fair weather with a high of 72 and a low of 51. Humidity will be at 50 percent. We will, yeah, as I said, we will have fair weather. Winds will be at 7 miles an hour. But this will be the best weather day of the week. On Tuesday, it will be overcast with heavy rain with highs of 67 with a low of 49. Humidity will be at 98 percent. And we will have heavy rain. On Wednesday, we will have heavy hailstorms that will continue on to Thursday. <clears throat> on Wednesday, we have a high of 36 and a low of 31, with humidity levels at 79%. We also have 50 mile an hour winds. On Thursday, we will be experiencing a light, we will likely be experiencing a big tornado with continuing hailstorms. There will be a high of 40 with a low of 30. Humidity will be at 80%, and, there's, and we're projecting winds to be at 145 mile an hour, 145 miles per hour. On Friday, the tornado and hailstorms will be gone, luckily. We will still be experiencing heavy rainstorms. We have a high of 54 with a low of 47. Humidity will be at a ridiculous 100%, and we have winds at 24 miles an hour. That is your five-day forecast, so remember to have your umbrellas and coats ready. Back to you, RJ. Now for our commercial break. With the approaching tornado, Home Depot has all the supplies you need. From flashlights to batteries to generators, we have it all. During the last tornado, I got myself well prepared by getting everything I need from Home Depot. If you are interested, visit www.homedepotmyhome or visit a local store near you. We have 14 stores in the Houston area. Come down to any of our 30 locations in Texas. And remember, for any of your tornado needs, come down to Home, home Depot. Depot. Remember, Home Depot is the home for all of your tornado needs. Welcome back to the Wacky News Center at 6. As Matthew said, we will be experiencing a tornado on Thursday, so be sure to prepare for the tornado ahead of time. Poor weather conditions are expected on Thursday. Tornadoes will be possible. Hopefully nothing like the worst tornado in Texas history. That one, the Waco tornado, killed 114 people. Here's a picture of the Waco tornado damage. On Monday, we will be experiencing a warm front in the northwest causing fair weather. Tuesday through Friday, we will be experiencing stationary fronts, also from that will cause the station uh, stormy weather. Now, I'm going to talk about the winds for this week. On Monday, we will have fairly calm winds at 7 miles per hour. On Tuesday, we will have winds that will be get a little faster and will reach 12 miles per hour, relatively calm. On Wednesday, we will have what we think the winds will speed up and reach 50 miles per hour. On Thursday, Astronomically, terrible winds at 145 miles per hour will likely cause the wind spread tornado watches throughout our viewing area. As we get closer to Thursday, pay atten careful attention to the regular weather reports. Uh, the winds will be rotating from east to west, and the wind should start be starting from the Gulf of Mexico into southern Texas. Now let's pull up the weather map for the U.S. As you can see, we're approaching warm and stationary fronts. In Texas on Monday, it will be partly sunny with a high of 72 and a low of 51. California, we will have a rainy, windy day with a high of 68 and a low of 64. In Minnesota, we will also have a partly cloudy day with a high of 43 and a low of 41. In, in beautiful New York, we will have sunny weather without a cloud in the sky. There will be a high of 67 with a low of 60. Finally, in Florida, we will have a beautiful day with a high of 87 and a low of 82. Now back to RJ for your local Texas weather report. Thank you, Matt. In Texas, we are expecting good weather all around in our, our all around our viewing area this Monday. But let me get into the specifics. In our capital, Austin, it will be a sunny day with a high of 72 and a low of 70. In Houston, we will have six, a high of 67 and a low of 60. It will be partly cloudy today, that day in Houston. Then, in Dallas, it will be nice and sunny with a high of 70 and a low of 64. Now back to Matt Minutes for the rest of your week. Thanks, Sergeant. On Monday, those lucky people in San Antonio will be enjoying a high of 72 with a low of 69. It will be a very clear and sunny day. 
Finally, in El, pa in El Paso, people will not be as lucky because they'll have an ugly day filled with lots of clouds and a high of and low 54. You can see a lot of clouds over here in El Paso. I'm Matt Bennis. And I'm Marjorie Jira. And, and that's your 6 o'clock wacky news center weather report.